Sheikh Hasina's homecoming day today, Bangladesh became a role model under her leadership to the outer world. Two army personnel killed and two others injured in separatist group Kona Ambush on army patrol in Bandarbans, Ruma. Kaladas please six cancellation to the High Court of Chairs of Framing in Nyko Craft case. Assalamu alaikum, welcome to my TV news. I'm Farhan Yasmin with you in the news and today watching headlines. Now the details. Today is the historic homecoming day of Awami League President and Prime Minister Sheikh Hasina. On 15 August 1975 of this day, father of the nation, Bangabundhu Sheikh Mujibur Rahman was killed and his family returned to the very Bangla soil after a long exile on 17 May 1981. With the love of the people, Sheikh Hasina has been making a groundbreaking contribution to the socio-economic development of the country by getting the opportunity to run the state for the third consecutive time and the for the fourth time. Abdullah Ali Al Hamoudi, the newly appointed UAE ambassador to Bangladesh, paid a courtesy call on Prime Minister Sheikh Hasina today in the morning. The ambassador paid a courtesy visit to the Prime Minister official residence, Gono Bhavon. Prime Minister Sheikh Hasina congratulated the newly appointed. Ambassador, the Prime Minister expressed confidence that the good relations between Bangladesh and UAE will further increase. Meanwhile, Ambassador Ali Abdullah Khashif Al Hamoudi expressed his hope that United Arab Emirates will always stand by Bangladesh development. Two army personnel were killed in an ambush by the Kukichin National Army on an army patrol in Bandabon's Ruma. Besides, two more people were injured in this incident. The Directorate of the Inter-Services Public Relations, ISPR, confirmed this information in a press release today. According to ISPR, based on intelligence information, an army patrol led by Major Monwar went there after receiving information about the presence of armed terrorists in Zalulchari neighborhood under Shangunpara Army Camp. As the patrol approached the water spill near uh, Zarulchori Para, Kukichi National Army terrorist came under IE blast and started firing, and the injured succumbed to their injuries while a rush to the Chittagong Savage by helicopter. Meanwhile, two other injured officers are currently undergoing treatment. Army Chief General SM Shofiuddin Ahmed has expressed grief over this incident. BNP Chairperson Begum Khalizia has appealed to the High Court seeking cancellation of the NICO graft case. Lawyer Kaiser Kamal filed this application on the behalf of BNP Chairperson Khalizia. On March 19, Judge Sheikh Hafizur Rahman on Dhaka Special Judges Court 9 established in building number 2 of Kirani Gonj Central Jail ordered the trial to begin against eight accused, including BNP Chairperson Khalizia. After that, he fixed May 20. 23 as the date for taking testimony in this case. The day Kaldazia's lawyer Masood Ahmed Talukdar said that he appeared on behalf of Kaldazia. The Cyber Crime Unit of the Anti Terrorism Unit of the Police has arrested 19 members of the fraudster who gave financial loans through a various application online. Superintendent of Police Farhana Yasmin, who is in charge of the drive, confirmed the arrest in a press conference at the head office of the organization today. He, she said that this gang had rented an office in a house of Thora Sector 11, the capital, and had been doing this for a long time. This officer also said that seven more members of this ring were arrested earlier. 
The election commission has authorized 90 observers from three observation agencies to observe the polls in the upcoming five city corporation election. Assistant Public Relations Director of the Election Commission, Muhammad Asadul Haq, information this information today. 19 observers from three local organizations have been authorized to observe the vote. In this regard, it has been said that a Gajipur city corporation election will be held on May 25. Kulna and Borisha on June 12 and Ratcha and Silla City Corporation election on June 21. The election commission authorized observing agency shall collect the identity card and vehicle sticker from the office of the concerned returning and assistant returning officer. No conspiracy can stop Sheikh Hasina progress, says the Dhaka South City Corporation Mayor Barrister for Sheikh Fosli Nur Taposh. He made this comment after inaugurating the picture exhibition and voluntary blood donation program on the occasion of Prime Minister Sheikh Hasina's 42nd homecoming day at 32 Thanmont in the capital. He also says seeing the development of the country, a group is conspiring against the government. Everyone should be vocal against them. Viewers now international news. At least four people were killed in a gun attack on the convoy of the U.S. Embassy in Nigeria. Two were among the deceased were embassy staff and two were police officers. Beside the attacker also kidnapped three people, including two police officers. International media reported this information in a report today. According to the international media reports, gunmen abducted three people during the attack on Tuesday near Athani town in the Anambra Strait, Nigeria. Among the three abducted are a driver and two police officers. At least two people were killed in a terrible explosion in the northern Spanish city of Oreo. The regional security department of the country confirmed this information on Tuesday. It is said that the explosion happened around 4.30 p.m. local time. There was a loud explosion on a bench on the sidewalk. There was a children's play area a little away from it. According to the police, a woman and a man sitting on the bench died on the spot. However, no one else were injured in this incident. The cause of the explosion is yet to be known and no one claimed responsibility for that hack. We are about to land the headlines once again. Sheikh Hasina's homecoming day today, Bangladesh became a role model under her leadership to the outer world. Two army personnel are killed and two others injured in a separatist group, Kanambushu, on army patrol in Bandarbans, Ruma. Khaledas please six cancellation to the High Court of the Chairs of Fame in Naiko Craft case. At least two four killed and three, including police officer, kidnapped in a gun attack on the convoy of the U.S. Embassy in Nigeria. Inter Milan in UEF Champions League final after 13 years defeating SC Milan by Martinez goal. Thanks for being with us. To join with MyTV News on the YouTube slash MyTV News to watch all our programs YouTube slash MyTV Bangla, Facebook slash MyTV Bangla. Our next bulletin will be telecast 7.30 p.m. Stay connected and Allah Hafiz.